Parents and staff at one Niagara County School District are fed up with the constant traffic around their schools. They say that the congestion has caused dangerous conditions for young teenage drivers. Two on your side's Kelly Dudzik tells us what's being done to fix the problem. This issue represents a matter of critical importance to parents, students, <laughs> and the community alike. Lewiston Porter Central Schools is calling on the State Department of Transportation to install a traffic light at the intersection of Route 18, Creek Road, and Darrell Johnston Drive, or at the campus's main entrance. The district says traffic congestion makes it hard to maneuver, even for experienced drivers. A lot of very young students who are new to driving are coming on this campus, and this will be constant for anywhere from almost a half hour to 45 minutes in the morning that we're very concerned. Superintendent Paul Caseri has been at Lewiston Porter School since 2005. He says there's been a problem for years, but that it's gotten worse due to a recent bus driver shortage and the pandemic both causing students and parents to drive to school themselves. In my time, we've had four or five accidents here. One a, one a pretty serious accident. So this can be a very, very difficult corner, particularly as young drivers are trying to make the left out onto a state highway. Brian Michelle has three kids attending Lewiston Porter schools. Michelle and Kasseri submitted the application after Michelle was almost hit while driving with his son. How many close calls do we need to have before this matter is taken seriously by the DOT and addressed. The DOT responded to the application saying it will conduct a study but calls for patience while it gathers data. The superintendent says the district wants a traffic light up in time for the fall semester. Kelly Dudzik, Channel 2 News.